Hello and welcome to Wonder Meat. Wonder Meat! It's a vlog kind of unboxing loot crate thing, ladies and gentlemen. Yes, I got a loot crate through. Look at this loot crate. It's got all sorts of wonderful things. It's got a launch base on the back of it. Um, it's got hashtag loot crate that should be appearing on the bottom of your screens. And it's got wonderful gaming items in it. Um, my friend actually <laughs> told me about it, so I thought, why not go and try and get my hands on one? This is the January 2014 one, and we're going to see what's inside it. So uh, I've already unboxed it, sliced it here. It's come from the US, so if you're in the UK, you can also get one, which I was a bit shocked about. Oh, look at this. Tips for the perfect unboxing. Document. Don't forget to photograph and film your unboxing. Well, we're filming it right there. It's the tips right there. I'm reading them. So, what else is there? What is in this delightful crate? Well, first of all, we have the Loot Crate Issue five, issue 6. sorry, And it's a launch edition. It's got a little space, uh, space minute. And this basically tells you what's in it. So far as to go through it, uh, it tells you pages after pages of what's actually in it so there you go um you've got a sudoku puzzle there what's actually in it things like that but we're going to see them so we don't need to show you that we just show you the front cover there what do we got we have a domo a domo superman a vinyl figure this looks cool he's, he's in a he's in a cute little box let's get him out of there he's right there look at him Put that box over there. Don't need a box. What else we got? Got a book. Put that there. We have a sticker. We have a melting Rubik's Cube. We have a... I, I know that's from Star Trek. I know it is, but I can't see... I think it goes like there. There on me. Does it, does it look good? Does it look good? I don't know. <laughs> Oh, look at this. A NASA a NASA space badge. Yeah, that's one of the ones that you sew on to. Um, when you had uh, Cub Scouts, it reminds me of when you used to sew on your patches as you earned them. I feel like I could be an astronaut. Now I have this. <laughs> what else we got in here? We have a badge. So, oh yes. <laughs> this badge, I'll tell you more about it later, but it's a very special pin badge, this one. We have a Star Wars pocket uh, pocket model trading card game. Game pack. This is a game pack. Very cool. And last but not least, something I'm very excited to see in this box. We have a Minecraft mini 2014 calendar. This is a, a beautiful. I actually really need a calendar. I, I, <laughs> I can't believe the... Uh, the luck of it. I actually need a mine. I need a calendar, and why not have a Minecraft one? And look at that. It's beautiful. You've got you got these. Uh, each one obviously has a has a nice drawn piece. The Great Squid Migration by Christine. What is in the loot crate? Let's go through these items one by one. First of all, we have this sticker of a melting Rubik's cube. Now. <laughs> this is how my brain feels every time I do the, <laughs> I do a Rubik's cube. I sort of get to I get to solving it, and then suddenly it melts. It just starts to all turn into a blur of colours for me. I don't get it. It's it's confusing for me. Uh, <laughs> very cool though. I shall be using it. We have. I think we should talk about these together. So because this is a launch box, um, the uh, big thing about this is that it's actually been to space, or these these badges, I should say, have been to space. They've been. Uh, they went in launch. They went up. They came down again, and we have them. They've been distributed to anyone who had uh, this chat. So that's why it's very cool to me. A very space themed the whole thing. Um, I'm not sure when Minecraft comes into space, but Galacticraft. Mm. <laughs> You're sure with the mods and everything. So of course we have a NASA space badge, and we have this as well, which is very very cool. I love it. Love it. I shall be wearing it. And uh, of course then we have this thing from Star Trek. Something from Star Trek. I've not seen Star Trek in a long time, ladies and gentlemen, but I know it is a thing. Next up, we have a Star Wars pocket model ground assault game. Um, it says on the back here, you punch them, build them, and play. 
It sounds like an action-packed game, space-themed again, Star Wars. I've seen a lot of Star Wars, a lot more Star Wars than I've seen Star Trek. <laughs> and, yeah, I, I look forward to playing it. Um, it says, it's a six-card game, 30. I don't know what 30 means, but yeah, uh, looks cool. It's for two to eight players and should be about 25 minutes of fun. A nice lunchtime game for me to play at work. Maybe. Mm. <laughs> uh, we have a phrase book. Very good for on your intergalactic travels, I say. Very good indeed. Look at these. <laughs> got a galactic phrase book. If I open it on a random page... That's not got any phrases on it. That's not got any... This one. Okay. Counting in uh, Javanese. Um, from 1 to 10, we'll try. Okay. Here's a case. Oh, seven does not exist. Just saying. Uh, so we've got pu, ko, kuyo, yo, duyo, lilo. Seven doesn't exist. Ho, to, kiziwan. Kiziwan. One, one uh, hundred is galaxwan. And then you've got one thousand is hikasiswan. I think I need to work on my pronunciation. But yeah, it's all there in this book. I'm not making it up. <laughs> so there you go. Um... I will take the insurance. Ikigo kana. Ikigo kana. I'm, I'm sorry if I offend anyone. <laughs> I tried. Uh, Minecraft calendar, of course. Great, great little item. A beautiful. <laughs> For June. It's a very wet month. Um, actually, May's more of a wet month, but... <laughs> It's just oh look at the squid. And these are all um pieces of art taken by other bits, um other people. Um we have this little guy. Uh, my little figurine, vinyl figurine. He'll go well with my little uh, male chimp over there. And uh my little hip mom figurines as well. Got lots of little bits and bobs everywhere really. So yeah, they'll they'll go well together. And of course then you've got the book to read through it all. So that's it, ladies and gentlemen, the loot crate. Uh, what did you guys think? Let me know in the comments below. Of course, if you did enjoy this vlog, uh, please leave a uh, like below. And if you do want to see more of our content, then why not consider subscribing? And that's, <laughs> that's all I've really got to say. It's uh, <laughs> it's nearly quarter to one in the morning, so I'm going to vlog off. Vlog off? Really? Well, it's very flogtastic while I'm at it. It might give me very floggy outside. It's actually quite foggy, you see, floggy. <laughs> Blame Stuart for the puns.